Oh, there you are. We're all going to uh, Hagakure. Wanna come? Wow, that was easy. Akihiko-san's buying. You remember that bet we made in Yakushima? Uh, you probably forgot all about it by now. Well, you won in the end. Even if it was, I guess. But whatever. Akihiko-san's still lost, right? It took me like six months to make him accept that fact. So come on, everyone else already left. We gotta hurry. Is the special okay for everyone? Okay. Five specials, please. Man, this is awesome. Akihiko-san's never treated us all to ramen before. Hey, why do I have to treat everyone? <laughs> Not this again. Come on, Akihiko-san. A bet's a bet. Pay up. All right, all right. I never said I wouldn't. What's wrong, I guess? You doubting me too? No, but have you seen the magazine on that counter? There's an article in it that looks highly disturbing. Which magazine? It's... This one, Emergence of a Messiah, the charismatic one speaks. Huh, it must be about that doomsday cult. They're all over the internet, too. Hmm. Huh? Hey, look at the photo in this. Check out the so-called Messiah. What the? I is that Takaya? I thought something was up. So, Strega's behind that cult. <sighs> I've lost my appetite. Listen to what he says. Mankind is currently imprisoned by the sins of hate and anger. But soon, a savior will descend upon this world to break the chains that bind us and lift us to new heights. This great being is Nyx. I have beheld her glory, and she has blessed me with power beyond belief. In Nyx, there is no pain, no suffering. How the hell does he know about Nyx? Wait, he's saying that Nyx will save the world? That's not true! I don't think he really means what he's saying. This is all just a game to him. That son of a bitch. But there are those who do not understand this truth, even though they have also been blessed by her. They have acquired the same power as I, yet they abuse it, using it for their own personal gain. These miscreants are the ones to blame for the recent tragedies that have been plaguing our streets. Wait, is he talking about us? Shh, not so loud. Oh, sorry. Hey, what's up with them calling him the charismatic one? How did he get so popular all of a sudden? Well, Jin's pretty well known on the internet. He's probably pretty good at stirring up trouble. Yeah, I bet he orchestrated Takaya's rise to fame. Oh, those two make me sick. Brothers and sisters, I shall go forth to make preparations for Nyx's arrival. But do not fear those evildoers who desecrate their gifts. Nyx shall right their wrongs. May your hearts be filled with peace as you await your salvation. Blessed are those who take joy in the coming of Nyx. The revolution is here. Revolution? People can't seriously be buying this crap, can they? Throughout history, those who have changed the future have often been highly charismatic. That's the end of the article. It appears that after the interview, Jin and Takaya disappeared again. Well, there's only one place they could have gone. Tartarus. They must have been planning this all along. Takaya's words have changed the mood of the entire city. Even though they won't admit it, they are all afraid. Yeah. I mean, why else would people believe this nonsense Takaya's preaching? I guess people just need something to believe in. Well, no wonder there's a sense of doom in the air. We're all gonna die. But is that so surprising? The fact that all life ends one day has nothing to do with Nyx. Death is a natural occurrence in the cycle of life. Don't all humans realize this? I guess. To tell you the truth, I never even would have thought about my own death if none of this had happened. But since we've made up our minds, why don't we just leave it at that? Our objective is Nyx. If Strega gets in our way, we'll just have to deal with them too. I agree. We'll probably run into them at Tartarus anyways. However you look at it, we're the obstacle standing in their way. The promised day will soon be here. Yeah. We need to do all we can until then.
All right, and if that's the case, we're gonna need lots of energy. Let's eat. Excuse me, I'd like to order a hagakure bowl. You don't mind, do you, Akihiko-san? Junpei, don't forget you're having half of Igus's food too. Oh, don't worry, I'm starving. You just better eat it all.
today. Word. <laughs> 